Hey, what's going on YouTube? Will here from All Electric, back again with another video. And today we have the Be Cool Pathfinder. In this video, you are gonna get my complete review after using this for several weeks. Let's jump right in. Now let's start off with an overview of the controls. On the left hand, you have the front brake, of course, but you also have a little horn there and turn signals, which I really like. And check out this little LED magic here. Looks really fancy and super nice for little turn signals there on your rear brake light. Next, you have a little uh, control here that turns on the bike. You have a menu option and then also gives your power levels. You can see this beautiful, beautiful animation there on this color display that you have in front of you. That gives you five levels of power, shows you all the stats that you wanna see while you're riding, including the time, your vaults, really impressive. The one thing that I think is really rather silly, when you power on the bike, it says, always be cool. Okay, come on, be cool bikes. But other than that, really, really impressive. On the right hand grip, you have the twist throttle, which does operate from a stop, which is nice rear brake and of course your shifter single gear in the front and i believe eight gears in the rear now overall this thing is a beast these four inch tires provide plenty of traction on or off road and really really impressive and comfortable to ride as well i'm about six foot one and this seat position and or a riding position is very very nice on this really large e-bike now it does come standard with a rear rack metal pedals and a 750, yes, 750 watt motor. Holy power. This thing is really awesome to get on and just use that twist throttle. It almost feels very similar to like a moped or a motorcycle when you're riding this thing on some asphalt. Now, I will say that this is a rather heavy bike. So you can see me lift it up here, but do not expect to be like, you know, lifting this up over your head. It is a heavy e-bike, strictly for trail riding. Uh, it will also need probably one of the more heavy duty trailers that supports the tires from underneath if you plan on putting this on your car. But again, what it it's heavy because you have this huge motor the 750 watt motor and these four inch tires, but also just the power that that thing delivers is awesome. So on asphalt here going about 20 miles an hour and I pull the brakes trying to skid of course, but this braking system is really impressive. Again, I'm about 200 pounds. You can see that that front fork is controlling, making it really comfortable for me as a rider and just a really well-built overall e-bike. And I love the safety features of that rack and with the rear tail light and the front headlight as well. Now, when you're riding this thing, it's super easy just in pedal assist mode to just get going. This 750 watt motor kicks in with a cadence sensor very quickly if you start pedaling, but why pedal when you have a twist throttle right at your right hand? Really, really nice to operate. Now, just some stats on this bike. Again, a 750 watt rear hub motor, 48 volt battery, which gives an estimated range of 40 to 65 miles. In my testing, I never charged this thing and I did over 40 miles and it still had plenty of juice for this video that you see here. Really, really impressive battery chemistry there. You can tell that they're not using cheap parts like some other e-bike manufacturers. Now, if you're getting this for a commute to your work or something like that, and you have any sort of off-road section like you know there is no paved path that you need to ride on this is definitely going to be really good for your commute now if you do have to take it into your office or carry it for any portion i definitely don't recommend this because this is a heavy e-bike or if you have to lift it onto public transit or something like that I definitely do not recommend this, it's super heavy. But for most people, this is gonna be an excellent like weekend fun ride, or it's gonna be just a great thing to ride to work every day. These fenders make it so you don't have to worry about if it's wet on the ground, you're not gonna get a bunch of road spray all over you. Really, again, wanna reiterate that the traction that you get with these tires on and off-road is incredible. Bye-bye. Uh -huh. 
Now what you get in this e-bike I believe is a complete package, literally everything that you need, all the safety features for 1900 bucks, and it has free shipping from Be Cool's website. I really think this is a steal and if you're looking for an e-bike, definitely check out this one. All right, there you have it. That is my complete review of this Be Cool Pathfinder e-bike. If you wanna go and check one of these out, I'll have a link down below in the description. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching. Share this video with one of your friends and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. As always, catch you guys in the next one.